Watching the Strato Cruiser Cafe, which just a week before had taken her husband on his dramatic flight to Washington, Mrs. Attlee waits with the Foreign Secretary to welcome the Prime Minister on his return to Britain. Cathay, the old name for China, a very apt coincidence. China took him to consult with the President, and what they agreed must shape our policy. So far as most of us are concerned, that's in the future. But it's reassuring that Mr. Attlee made a very good impression in the States. Before leaving America for Canada, the Premier broke his journey at New York to visit the United Nations at Lake Success. Escorted by the Secretary General, Mr. Trigvali, Mr. Attlee sat next to the current president, Mr. Entizam, and reaffirmed his faith in UNO. I was present at San Francisco at the formation of the United Nations. I was present at an early meeting in London, and I'm quite convinced that we all have to stand together and make the United Nations an effective organization if we want to preserve peace in the world, happiness for mankind, and to lift fear from the common people. I thank you, Mr. President, for welcoming me here. Thank you, thank you so much. much.